Hello everybody, this is Wizworld 100 welcome to Sunday Showcase. Another late Sunday Showcase, thanks to a uh, little bit of a medical thing that was happening with my face. But, you know, I've gotten a little, I've gotten much, much better now. I'm healing, so that's why I've decided to get back to recording. So, uh, thanks for all, thank you all for joining, and today's game is going to be Jamestown, Legend of the Lost Colony. You're the viewers and I'm the showcaser, so let's get on with it. So here we are, Wolf Jamestown, The Legend of the Lost Colony. Let's get on to playing it. Start game. The thing that sucks is I have to play this entire game all over again. Well, it doesn't suck that bad, but it's just, uh, mm, divine. It doesn't suck that bad. It's just kind of like I, all that game time I put into it was just all lost. The only way, the only way you knew I ever played past anything was, uh, was, uh, Wolf the Achievements. Yeah, I'm ready. So this is a shoot 'em up, and if you don't already know, I love my shoot 'em ups. I'll pick this one. Pretty, the basic, standard ship. You get to pick uh, what ship type you want to play with. I must admit, nothing gonna prepare my. Oh fuck it. Oh great thing you can hold any button to skip it. I'm sure the story is wonderful, but I just came here for the gameplay. Chapter one: War against the East. So you get your regular attack which uh, and you don't really need power-ups in this game which is kinda nice then you got your special attack and Vaunt is where you collect more gears and the whole point or at least the way I see it is you gotta collect gears and I gotta watch out so I don't die ooh that was close come on hmm why is it lagging this much most curious that was close most curious you don't have bombs in this game which is hmm not every shoot 'em up needs a bomb, but it's kind of nice. And this seems to be like one of those uh, back to basic kind of sh uh, shoot 'em ups where you have that type of stuff. Oh, big ears reminds me of something from Donkey Kong Country. Got to dodge it all. Well, at least the lag is kind of helping me. Not that I intended it for that to happen. And that was me vaunting to protect myself from bullets. Oh, damn it. You want to try not to die because it reduces your score and how well you do on the level. Oh, come on! I am playing on the vine though, but even then, this is kind of pretty simple stuff. And I haven't played it in a while too, which is why I like Sunday Showcase, because it, it makes me go play games that I uh, normally skip out on. Oh, oh fucking what? Oh, it's start all over, start all over. That was shameful. But then again, it is once again on Divine. I'm gonna try and show off a few levels, at least 15 minutes worth of levels. Let's try and hit everything. I mean, typically I get killed whenever I uh, go and grab items. So let's just kill them all. Oh, my beam is purple. Oh my god, that was so close. If I recall correctly, it this actually powers up my attack, which is why it's all purple. Shit, 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 shit. No, you won't escape. No, he escaped. All right, you're dead. Oh, minor protection. Power up. Got to keep this combo going. Because when you vaunt, uh... I'm just trying to rediscover what I forgot about the game. When you vaunt, you get more powerful and you get more points. Oh, Come on, die! Oh, jeez. Uh, get the mother brain. Hmm, died a lot faster with the vaunt going on. Oh my god. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh yeah, there are also challenges in uh, this game too, so that's another thing. Oh, uh, mine. I think I can also vault cancel if I press the vault button again, but... Ah, I forget what that does. Oh, gee. Well, pressing it again does not do anything. I just confirmed that, because I died. Yeah, it's a lot of bullets, but I think it's more... It's it's a lot more reasonable than, uh... Most other games. Most other shooters like are specifically bullet hells. But that's its own genre of, uh... Difficulty. The Traitor Prince. Okay, he obviously starts off easy. Oh, 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 oh god, oh god! Oh god! Hmm. You know, for the, for the level divine, this is, uh... This is kind of weak, I gotta say. Oh, oh, oh god. Oh. 
I can't believe I got killed by that. That was pretty bad. Oh, he's halfway. Come on, dodge it, dodge it. Secret is to not get greedy. I don't know what I was supposed to do there. Well, aside from dodge. I pressed the Vaughn button, you fucking bastards. There, I pressed it, jeez. Oh, finally. Still wasn't a bad boss fight, I just sucked ass at it. So here's your score, I used the one credit. That's how many enemies I just destroyed. I'm a privateer. Uh, the score is important important because uh, that's how much coins you'll get that lets you level up. So another good aspect of this game is that your high score actually means something. That's what I like when the when the high score actually means something. Bonus levels now levels from the selection. Uh, look, here's a little shop. You can buy all the stuff to unlock, like new ships, uh, new actually mostly just new ships. Wait, I didn't want to buy it. Okay, so I bought the no the beam was already there. Gauntlet. I forget if I did buy that, because I'm pretty sure this game reset. Let's do at least the challenges. Well, let's save up all that money and go on to the next level. Well, let's go to the vine. It, it wasn't that hard, to be honest. We got the gunpowder, which, uh, you know what, let's, let's show it off. It's not what I usually play with, but, you know, let's take a look. Journey through the dark sector. Kind of weird for a western-type game. Well, it, this is certainly unique. Oh, jeez. You have missiles. Ah, he escaped. Oh, I charge up my little barrels and then I fling it at him. See, can, can you tell I don't play this ship that often? Ah, that's not very hard to dodge. But I'm not doing a good showcase of that now, am I? More power, more power. Okay, but definitely an interesting ship. Gotta, like, charge up your little attack. Oh, come on. I can't believe I dodged it that close. And then I just jinxed it right there. Can you die already? I also don't really remember this level. A special? What was so special about that? Well, my barrels become spike bombs. Oh, jeez. Fuck. <laughs> it's tough playing this ship. I don't, I don't like it that much. Oh, the barrels also shoot little cannons. That's cool. Interesting. Very interesting. This game is a lot of fun. You should totally get it. Okay, yeah, I remember this part now. Uh, the thing about this game is, I, if only it had online co-op, it would be so kick-ass. But no, it only has local, which, it's still pretty good. It's just it could have been so much better. Like, if you get what I mean. Like, this game it would totally kick so much more ass if it was, if it had online co-op. I'll take that, you have a, you have a JJ looking thing. Oh, jeez. Even though I don't like this, this is, even though this ship isn't, my kind of ship. It's still, I still think it's a very interesting ship to use. Where it's like, oh, you want to sacrifice your turrets for a little bit? Where you have less firepower? You know, all the all these decisions and stuff. Sacrifice turret, turret fire, or, you know, destroy an enemy really quickly. Interesting ship. I still prefer the beam ship, because beam weapons are cool. Ah! Damn it, he died before I even got to blow him up. Or before I threw the barrel at him. Gotta keep this vaunt up. Probably should have destroyed those. What die. Oh, jeez, die. Oh, they certainly aren't taking more hits. Oh, jeez, they, they evolve. Oh! Uh, vaunting time. This will make me invincible, as stated. Oh, jeez. Oh, this, 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 this game works. Would, oh, it would work great with two players. Because then you don't have to be all over the place. Ah. Come on, we gotta destroy them before they blow. Damn it. Ah, it's tough. Well, remember, it is on Divine, so... I'm just making it harder for it myself. Oh! Typically, I try to save my vaunt for something to, the f to protect myself, as opposed to just for the points, even though it would it is a very good idea for the points. Okay, you can cancel your Vaughn, but then that happens where you can't collect anything for it. It kind of sucks, but at the same time, if you die while you're in Vaunt, I think you still get your points, right? I haven't been paying that much attention. I'm just trying not to die here. Lady of the Lake. I believe this one is, is pretty easy, but don't take my word for it as I'm probably going to jinx it again. Uh-oh. It's going to beat me up. They're not giving me any gears. Uh-oh, I think I'm gonna die. I'm gonna get killed by this. Unless... 
could have escaped that if only my ship was a little faster. Which I don't think there is any speed re related deal with it. No! No! Oh god, I can't believe I dodged that. Oh, that's what made, That's why I like this game. It's, dodging is very... It's forgiving to the point, but not, not enough to actually, um... Not enough to be like... You know, it's so easy anyone can dodge it. You still need, like, some skill to dodge it. Oh, fuck it. Like I said, I would have really liked to save my vaunts. Kinda didn't mean to do that. You'd think with this simplistic of a control, how the hell would anyone, uh... Even make a mistake. Oh! 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 My god! Well, anyways. I'm, I'm starting to like this ship a little. Every ship has their little strength and weaknesses. No! Once you lose all your credits, that's it. I got killed by something underneath. I, could, I, 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 I knew that. Well, that's Jamestown. Pretty fun game, even though I lose uh, and get killed pretty quickly. But I'd still go, go and check it out. And the DLC... If you like the game, I'd say get the DLC. It's probably going to be pretty fun. I'm, I don't remember if I did get the DLC, though. I'll have to double check. But, you know, this game is lots of fun. It's tons of fun. And you can play it with people, too. Only downside is no online co-op. But aside from that, it's an awesome game. So, with that said, this is Whisper 100. You're the viewers, and I'm the showcaser. So, be sure to vote on the Sunday showcase poll so that you guys will have an influence on where the show goes. And like I said, this time I'm gonna just wait until there are a lot more votes before I actually decide on what to pick. So there's not always like a deadline or something that you have to do every week. So I hope you uh, enjoyed this episode of Sunday Showcase. See ya!